What really obvious thing have you only just realized? You can't fix people that much. Even if they go along with wanting to change, the change will be very tiny and extremely slow or not at all because some things can't be changed. There are some people who have major limitations that are not obvious by looking at them, including problems with executive functioning. It's not as easy as just telling someone to do something differently, and then they do it. Once in a while, this is possible, but definitely not all the time. I only just today realized that the warp the plank plank on a boat is not a special addition. Pirates added to their ships as a means of public execution that looked like a little wooden diving. Dord. It is, in fact, the very same plank as the gangplank you'd normally use to get on and off of the ship. It is not the presence of the plank that is threatening, but the absence of dock. People are vacant and look for any excuse to justify their unbearably obnoxious stupidity. Look, this is just the way things are done. I just don't understand why we have to print out 45 pages to put in a binder, where it will sit for 30 days before being shredded. Couldn't we have just burnt down a forest and cut out the middleman? I realized that to be in one's birthday suit it means to be without clothes. I thought for the longest time it was a specific set of clothes you would wear on your birthday. Each year, I found out when I asked, what happens when you don't fit in your birthday suit anymore, lol. I was about 30 yo and actually read when you assume you make an ass of you and me. I have heard it countless times, knew it meant not to assume, but never thought about it. Then I read the words and realized that you me. This was years ago. So didn't just now realize. Did it farts? I am not responsible for other people's lives. Feels a little better accepting that I don't have to stress too much over supporting my family. I shouldn't feel too overwhelmed to the point of having suicidal ideations just from the stress. Alone. I recently realized that the YKK on zipper stands for Yoshida Kojo Kobusha Kaikasha, which is the name of the Japanese company that manufactures a significant portion of the world's zippers. I've used zippers my entire life and never knew that. Not me. That my to one year cousin just realized he is mildly allergic to peanut butter and has been his whole life. Up until now, he had assumed everyone's throat closed up a little while eating a PBJ sandwich. But they just fall through it. I've been a Weird Al fan for my entire life. I've listened up I want a new duck endless times for decades. Only recently did it occur to me when he says and show me how to get down. Get IT. He is referring to down feathers. Not something I just realized but seems relevant. There is no point in driving yourself crazy over things and situations you have no control over. Especially people. Prioritize yourself and know. It's not being selfish. In my early 20s, I learned from a radio announcer that Jana Jackson's song is Escapade. Not Escapade. To be fair. Hearing it as a kid I didn't know the word Escapade at all. But I knew what the Escapades were. I was 50, 50 fucking years old, when I learned that bats are not, in fact, blind, evidently. I'm an idiot. So, if being oblivious to something so basic for literally half a century counts, yeah, that. I kept getting ads for Auto Trader, and I honestly thought it was a weird dating app for a bit, as it said help you find the perfect one in the ads, and I don't pay much attention to the ads lol. I must have been around 11, 12 years old, when I realized that an order of appearance during the end credits of a movie doesn't list the actors actresses by who is the most good looking. I recently realized I was allergic to carrots. I just thought they made everyone's mouth numb, you know, just like almonds. I also learned recently that I have an almond allergy. How the American bail system works. I thought it was a sum of money you paid to avoid jail. I was surprised when I realized you get the money back if you show up for your trial. A banana split is called a banana split because you get one banana that's split down the middle. Never thought of that until my husband was certain you get to whole bananas. I recently realized that howdy is short for how do you do. I actually just googled it, and it's technically short for how do ye, however, my realization still makes sense. That when I was a kid and my dad would take me to the video store on Friday nights, and he would go into the back room where only adults were allowed, that he was looking at porn. That sign you see near schools with the two people crossing holding books. I was stuck in traffic a few weeks ago, 
and suddenly realized it wasn't to women with purses. Don't judge me. About a year ago I realized salmon colored means the inside of the salmon. I was always so confused because salmon are not pink on the outside. It's cheaper if you know a mechanic. I've had to alternate between my brother-in-law and a local shop and it's nearly 3x times more. Descaring you. I didn't know the guy who voices Peace Bore also voices Kevin from Ben 10 Alien Force Omniverse. Now that I know I hear it but I've never noticed before. In the song I saw mummy kissing Santa Claus it's the husband dressed up as Santa and kissing his wife. Mummy is not having an affair with Santa. There is a local plumbing company called Abacus with a tagline you can count on us. After 20 years I realized their logo was an Abacus. My wife and I are both in our 50s. She told me recently that she just realized the song Black Velvet by Alana Miles is about Elvis. Water towers are for water pressure. Not just a town putting its name on a tank and saying hey look how much dang water we have. It's been a long time now, but I remember being way too old when it suddenly hit me that buffaloes don't have wings. I learned a couple years ago that it's not the mayor of bad news, it's actually the bearer of bad news. I'm 25. I just realized that the snooze button on my alarm clock isn't a magical portal to give me extra sleep time. That the drummer for Nirvana really was Dave Grohl. And not just a guy that looks really similar. That the phrase mint condition means like new because it's the condition coys leave the mint in. It took me a long time to realize the Superman logo was an S and not some Kryptonian symbol. Heard this on a podcast yesterday. It's from that 70s show. FES foreign exchange student. That big ships will I got to turn as a kid was not actually controlling the cruise ship. That the opposite of her board is all ashore. Learned this yesterday and I was surprised. That the sound of a snap is your finger hitting your hand. Not rubbing off your thumb. That my ex-girlfriend never really wanted to be with me and pretty much just led me on. A few weeks ago I found out that Disney World and Disneyland are not the same thing. That a scredit is an AI training area. Not necessarily a bad thing. That dim falling out of love from the person I fought so much to be with. You dice food by cutting it into little cubes about the size of dice. People who ask for advice only want to hear what they want to hear. For the longest time. I always thought prima donna was prima donna. When I was 15 I realized rice isn't pasta chopped in small pieces. It was a while before I got that a bogo sale meant by one get one. I have more yesterdays than tomorrows at this point in my life. It's called a windshield because it shields you from the wind. That it's called metal because it's harder than rock music. That lockers and lockness is the Gaelic word for late.